Hey guys, Pete here with GIS Solutions, and today I'm going to show you how to add a checkbox to your layer control in your leaflet map. I'll put a link in the description below on a video I did about creating the layer control where we added different base maps, and also a link to a video that we did where we added GeoJSON data. So to show you, in our project folder, we have our map data, which is my GeoJSON file, and I have a variable called map data. Going back to my HTML structure, you can see right here, I had a script that's calling that map data.js. So right now, if I run this, I can see that I have my layer control where I could toggle between a couple different base maps. And here's my GeoJSON data. It's just a bunch of random points here in the state of Utah in the United States. So what we want to do is add a check mark right in this layer control where we could toggle on and off these points. So to do that, we will go down to our leaflet layer control, and we're going to add another variable. So the variable will be overlay maps equals and then we're going to call it map data and you can call this anything you want anything that makes the most sense within these parentheses here and then the actual file name mine's called map data so i'm going to say map data okay and now this is our layer control right now we just have the base maps right here which is our three that I should, uh, showed you just a minute ago. And all we have to do here is add a comma and overlay maps. Okay, and we will run that. And in our layer control, you can see right here, we have our toggle for our map data. Anyway, I hope that helps. Uh, we'll continue to build upon this map. We'll do map clustering and a bunch of other different functionalities to our leaflet map. So please subscribe and like if you like this kind of video. And as always, please leave a comment down below. If you have any questions, I'd be more happy to get back to you. Thanks so much for watching.